Bad news for Packer fans, Aaron Rodgers suffered a broken collarbone after getting driven into the ground by linebacker Anthony Barr. Packers quarterback was able to walk to the sidelines immediately after the hit, but then he was carted off to the locker room. If you recall, Rodgers also broke his collarbone back in 2013. He missed seven games that year. Green Bay went 2-4-1 and one in his stead. So, Dylan McGordy, I ask you, Brett Hundley, the UCLA kid, had come in, except for the first series for the Packers, three picks later, a loss to Minnesota. Can they be competitive in this division with Hundley at the helm, or do they have to go outside of the organization? Yeah, no, no, yeah, no. They cannot be. Um, it's over. Yeah, that, that's, that's what this team is. He's the heart and soul of this team. He's arguably the best player in the league. Mm. When you think of quarterback play being integral to success in this league, and him being just about as efficient and dynamic from the quarterback position as anyone in this damn league. It's not an indictment on Brett Hundley, but no. he's just not even in the same stratosphere as discount double check. That's just the way it works. We saw that when he came in. Minnesota easily took control of the game, never looked back. Hundley throws three picks, and Green Bay's out of it. You could take this small sample size and extend it to however long Aaron's out. Now, they're not willing to say – it's for Definite the, season right. ending. They keep saying potential season ending. You know, where are they going to be when he does come back? If it is a seven-game mark, which is the last time this happened to him, and they miss seven games, mm. you know, we're well into the season, and are they too much behind the eight ball and have dug themselves too much a hole to really make a run at the playoffs with him back? I tend to think that is the case. I don't think they're a winning team without him. They're suffering a lot of injuries already, just getting their line back together. Yeah just getting their kind of backfield and some of their skill players back, but it all revolves around 12. And if Rodgers ain't there, they're not going anywhere. I tend to agree. It, it feels like it's still a winnable division because the division right now it seems to be up in flux. But without A-Rod, there seems to be no way, I'm with you, that they can compete in this division. And again, no offense to Brett Hundley. Might be his time. I know people are going to clamor for Colin Kaepernick and maybe somebody outside. We'll find out what they decide to do. they got to get a quarterback yeah. if he's done for the year. But at least right now, he's done for the foreseeable future out with that broken collarbone.